Hi readers. Today I found a really interesting article for us to read on News ELA and I can't wait to show you. So watch me as I go through the article. Oh, I know you're going to love this. So in your Google Classroom today or in your News ELA app on your Clever account, I have a, you will see this article I've assigned for you. Science. Chicago Aquarium releases penguins after exhibits close due to coronavirus. So what are some clues that we see here in the title that tell you when and where this article takes place? Right, it tells us it takes place in Chicago and during the coronavirus pandemic. So that means that it's happening right now. Let's read on to see. Look at these little penguins. I think these are emperor penguins. Do you see his hair? That's a pretty cool haircut, penguin. Image one, the morning of March 15th, 2020. Edward and Annie, those are the names of the penguins, explored the main floor at Shedd Aquarium in Chicago, Illinois. They are a bonded pair of rock hopper penguins, which means they are together for nesting season. Aww. So let's see, what do Edward and Annie do when they're set loose in the aquarium? So today, students, you're going to read this article. I also want you to complete the activities. So you'll click on the activities tab, and you'll see three different activities that you need to complete today for your reading assignment. One are the power words. So you're going to click on the power words. This is the teacher version, so it's showing you the answer, but you will be asked a question, and then you need to click on the right answer. There are 10 questions for the power words. Then you will do the right. So after you read the article, you will need to write a paragraph that explains the central idea of the text. Central idea. What does that mean? Yeah, it's like what it's about. Use at least two details from the article to support your response. So readers and writers in fourth grade use details to support their response. So what does that mean exactly? Let's, let me show you an example. Write a paragraph that explores the central idea. Well, the central idea would be, I'm not going to give it away, but along the lines of the lives that these penguins live when they were set into the aquarium. Some penguins went on a field trip to meet other animals at Shed. So maybe you'll say in your paragraph, this article is about the lives of penguins in the Chicago Zoo when they were set, or the Chicago Aquarium when they were set loose during the corona pandemic. I believe this was an exciting time for the penguins because... I read that they went on a field trip to meet other animals. You see how I did that? I used evidence. Then finally, you will take the quiz. It's a four question quiz. And look here, you already have one answer. So you need to complete those activities. Now, I, do, when they said they went on a field trip, look at this students, look at this. Other animals went on field trips too. Hector, the Patagonia Mara, took a walk at Fort Worth Zoo in Fort Worth, Texas. <gasps> wow, so that means that other zoos and aquariums were doing the same thing. The otters, Benji, Hudson, and Makita, appeared to be curious about their new visitor. Wow, so this sounds like other zoos and aquariums were doing the same thing. They were opening up their zoos and aquariums because humans couldn't come to enjoy the zoo and the aquarium. So they said, well, why not just let the other animals walk around? Now, the last part, zoo cams, you'll read. And then I have an exciting thing for us for 
science today that's going to set us up for our science project next week. Zoos are also closed due to coronavirus concerns. Some have stayed connected with the public by live streaming shows with popular animals. So students today for science, we are going to be watching those shows. So first, please read this article about why, why and how animals are walking around aquariums and zoos. So I do wanna point out that there's no people going to the zoo and the aquarium during the coronavirus because that's a place for people to gather. It's a public space. And right now we're not allowed to go to those spaces. So they said, well, the animals live here already. We'll just let them walk around. <laughs> so readers, enjoy your article and the activities. And I can't wait to see your paragraphs you write about it.